Hey guys, Hikari here, coming at you live from my house, welcoming you to following Rayloff with the Trojan Panther. Yeah, no. What? Where? Oh, here. Okay, let's just go check it out then. The Guardian Stone is discovered. Activate Mage Stone. Um, under the sign of the Mage, we'll learn... Uh, no. What's this? A Thief Stone. Those are... Okay, Stealth Skill is 20% faster. Nah. Warrior Stone. Combat Skills! Said warrior stone added, so oh, I'm gonna learn that stone. Tome spells or spell tomes are you? You can eat them or use them, um, and you and then you can learn that spell. So that's really useful. I don't get it. Do you use like magic? No, but our favorite is sparks right there. Sparks is a really cool looking spell. Ooh, harvest this soul. Okay, so let's go to our map. We're finally in the open world of Sky Rim. What the fuck? This is why I hated this game when it first came out. This object right here, known as a mountain, there are several blocking nearly every place you have to go, whether it be a tiny one like this. Or a large one like these. Uh, there's a little valley here that you could pass through, but getting to this place was a total bitch. Whatever. Anyway, so what do we need to do? We need to go to Riverwood. And I didn't even see where that was. Okay, Riverwood is actually right over here, so let's just make a marker. Beautiful. What are you doing? Holy sir. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Anything that seems to pop out from the background, you could probably harvest. And if you do, you could use it for alchemy. I'm actually going to try to get into alchemy a little bit more in this playthrough, but I don't know how well that's going to work out. We'll see. Whoa! Okay, I'm just thinking, see, the fastest way to just, well, you, here, let me explain thing, one thing at a time. Unlike Oblivion, you can't just fast travel to any city because you haven't discovered it yet. So, the fastest way to do it is to get to a city that has a carriage, pay them to take you to all the cities, and then that way you will discover them all and be able to fast travel there. So, yeah. That looks harvestable. I don't know if this place has a carriage, though. That's the thing. Uh, let's take get rid of that marker. What? What is it now, Mother? It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It flew right over the barrel. If you keep on like this, <laughs> all right. So this guy right here. This guy is good. He teaches you the the uh, basics of blacksmithing. All right. So you use the so you use blacksmith's forge. Therefore, you make an iron dagger. 
Now we have to bring the dagger to Alvor. Here's the iron dagger. The dull, so we have to. So you have to use a grindstone to make it a fine iron dagger. Yes, iron dagger, fine. Craft, yes. Alright, now here, here's the sharpened iron dagger. Okay. Now we need some armor. So now we need to get some leather. Alright, leather, yes. Leather, yes. Leather strips, I think. You the sneaky type. Here's the leather. Good. Lots of weapons and armor need leather for sure. Let's see if you can make a hide. All right. Now we use a workbench, and then we make a. Um, wait. Wait a minute. Did I just screw up the quest? Please tell me I didn't screw it up. Wait a minute. What do I need to do? Craft a hide helmet. Whatever you need. Do I make it in here? Oh, I guess I do. Damn, I'm an idiot. Alright, bring the hide helmet to L4. Okay, okay. Here's the hide helmet. Alright, we have to prove it. We have to prove armor at the workbench. That's what I was getting confused with. So, hide helmet, you craft it, yes. And then, finally, you give it to him. You have to Keep working at your craft. You'll be a fine spit one day. Why don't you keep that bag yourself? Maybe you remember me when you're making Skyport steel, huh? Alright. Okay. Alright, that was a quick rundown of smithing. We could steal this stuff, but I'm better than that. Excuse me. Alright, um I'm looking for a carriage. Well, actually, what what do I need to do here? What's my talk to Girder in Riverwood, Embry? Oh, I hate being sick. It sucks. Any hoozle, let's look in the Riverwood Trader. Ooh, I can sell some of my stuff here. Got some gold. The only pro oh yeah, the only problem with using the carriages is that you actually need gold to use it, so yeah. Girder! No. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Wait, did something happen? Yeah. We did have a bit of a, a break here. We still have plenty to sell. Lovers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. What? I can help you get the claw back. I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Oh, bitchin'. Now, if you're going to get the thief, you should head to East Falls Barrow, northeast of town. Okay. Yeah. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... By the ace, fine. But only to the edge of town. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. The suit? Take a look. Alright. Barter, yes. Alright, before I sell, e or before I buy anything from you, I need to sell this. I need to sell that, because it's not worth anything. Fur boots. Uh, let's sell the hide shield. Sell the hide helmet. Nothing that's equipped. I don't like daggers, I don't like great swords. I'm gonna keep that iron and gut. I'm gonna sell the shield, sell the war axe, I'm gonna keep the leather, keep the lockpicks, keep one of the bows. Um, keep all my potions, keep that. I'm gonna sell that. Stormcloak Curse, and yeah. Alright. Do you sell spells? I think I have a few 
age-old spell book. Ah, uh, College of Winterhold. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasure. Spell tome clairvoyant. Shows the path to the current goal. Ooh, that could be really useful. Uh, I'll keep that in mind. Frostbite, blast of cold points, 146. Lesser ward. You know what I really want? Okay, so I'm a big fan of enchanted thing. I'm going to actually buy that frostbite one. And I'm going to uh, use it. All right. And then I also am going to favorite that. I favorite everything. So, yeah. Open Skyrim. I'm a big fan of enchanted things. And to, need, and to keep up with enchantments, you need uh, soul gems. And to fill soul gems, you need to capture souls from your dead enemies. So, what you have to do... Okay, thanks. Um... You need the Steel Soul spell, and I really want that. And there's also this object that I really want to get that makes it, that makes um, Soul Gems completely useless, and instead just makes it so freaking easy to keep up with your enchantments. Do I want to go to Bleak Falls Barrow now, though? I like the Golden Claw quest a lot, honestly, but I really do want to find Gerder to find. Not hot. Oh, fuck you. I ain't a freaking farmer. I don't know. The objective marker is pointing me towards there. Why didn't I think of that? I'm an idiot. Wait. What? What is he? Girder. Girder is over there. You're a woman. A fine day for you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hand. Um. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there's anything else you need, just let me know. Okay. Whoa. Dude. Ooh, silver granite ring. I'm going to sell that. Minor healing. Yeah, nothing else would really There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Yari needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Either would his defense them. Okay. We need to get word with your involved of the boyfriend to send whatever troops he can. If you do that for me, I'll be in your death. Okay, got it. Talk to the Yarl of White Run. Alright, where's White Run? White Run is way the hell no wait, way right there. I'm gonna ask around and see if I can find a. Sure. Shut the what fuck up. Dick. What can you tell me about River Wood? Generations ago, the Alright, whatever. We can't really fast travel there yet, so I'm just going to go there, and yeah, I guess I'll, I'll meet you anywhere where something interesting happens. The reason I'm not selling my stuff is because there's better traders at, at White Run, so yeah. Alrighty then, I will see you guys when something interesting happens. I am going to free.
term stateless imperials. It's imperial like fight or die well. Um, so I, I was walking to White Run and I just found these guys what? fighting a troll. No thanks to you. Fuck you! You didn't look like you needed help! Not, but a true warrior would relish the opportunity to take on the giant. That's why I'm here, with my shield brother. A shield brother? An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companion? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters with honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Uh, can I join you? Not for me to say. You have to talk to Cod like White Man, up in Probasco. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your work. If you go to him, good luck. I see. Yeah, the companion quest is actually really, really cool, and it has a really cool, um, uh, reward for it. So I think I'm actually going to do that. This guy is actually really important because he's going to be the one training us. You look strong. Come to your basket and be a companion. Damn straight I look strong. Jeez, who do you think you're talking to? I am the Trojan Panther, sir. Protector of Skyrim, didn't you know? Whatever. Anyway, we're just about here in White Run. We just discovered the White Run stables. I want this freaking horse. But can I buy a horse? Here's my offer. A thousand gold. Come back when you've got that Whatever. Yeah, I always like black horses or white stallions. I don't know, they just look so cool. Okay, so I have a story. In one file in my Red Dead Redemption, I was playing as, the, as a hero, and I had this awesome jet black horse, and I wore like the darkest outfit I could find. So at night, I just looked like this black silhouette riding through the night, saving innocence. It was so badass. Anyway, we're here. Ah. We made it to White Run, and yeah. Cool. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Um. I have news from Halligan about the dragon attack. Fine. We'll be keeping an eye on you. Nice. Oh, oh, oh. Also, a couple things happened on the way. Um. I saw Imperial soldiers leading a leading a stormcloak prisoner, um, and I I freed the prisoner and killed the things. And during that, I leveled up. So yeah, I'm leveling up here. When you level up, you have a chance to upgrade your health, stamina, and or magicka by ten, and you can also add a perk. Um, me personally, I generally go for the one-handed stuff first, simply because. Um, Sorry. Simply because that's what I use, and the more damage I can get on that, the better. A magical ward protects the caster from offensive spells, but takes a few seconds to charge up to full power. Yeah, and also, well, as you can see, I am like halfway to level three, so that's always good. Because my because my heavy armor increased because the Imperial soldiers. It was basically three on one, and they were hitting me a lot. And that's how you level up your heavy armor and light armor. White run discovered. Awesome. We'll whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? Huh. I'd sooner bend my knee to Olmert Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for no bitch. 
Have it your way. I'll take the job. But don't expect the miracle. Damn those prey things to oblivion. They want to back the storm close. They'll get what's coming to them. Oh, wait. Gray main or battle war. What? Got stones in your ears? I ask what side you're on. Gray main or battle war. I don't know what you're asking. New and down. Why do I have two plans? Both old and both respected. Difference is, the Grey Men has turned their backs on the Empire and we battle war and stay loyal. So I'll ask again, Grey Men or battle war? I'm, I'm not picking sides. Sooner or later, we all have to choose a side. Long live the Empire. Fuck the Empire. Whatever. Alright, so we're here in White Run, and first of all, I need to sell some shit. Um, Drunken Huntsman. Well, actually, what the f No, that's, a, that's an inn. That's an inn. Let's face it, that's an inn. Uh, Breeze Home. It's nighttime, so nothing is gonna be. Unlock War Maidens. Okay, so I'm gonna wait here. You can wait by pressing the select button and choosing how long you wanna wait. I'm actually gonna wait, thir wait 13 hours. That wait will be. Uh, 9.30 in the morning. And everything will be open. Alright. Open War Maidens. This place, I believe, uh, buys stuff pretty good for a pretty, pretty good price. So that's always good. I don't really care about the about the actual selling price, so long as they get out of my inventory. Because honestly, welcome to looking to protect yourself. In most cases, the yeah, I got an imperial bow too, so I got to actually sell that uh, wherever it is, the longbow. Wow, I really don't have much. I'm gonna sell these uh, steel arrows because I don't really need them right now. And I'm also going to sell. Nothing else. Okay. Alrighty then. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Well, I guess the first solution, the first step would be. Going to the Jarl of Windhelm, I guess. Now, where's that exactly? Well, it's probably in the highest place ever in the city. That was a rude little girl. Whatever. Ah. <sighs> Now, if you didn't know, uh, ooh, Dragon Threes, that's a cool name. So, if you didn't know, this game is based much, a lot on, uh, Vikings and, like, Nordic mythology. So, Jarls were actually, it, um, things in, uh, Viking times, and this game actually accurately represents them because, um, uh, excuse me, um, because, uh, in actual Nordic mythology, Jarls were held very high status, were independent, and they and they all have swore loyalty under the king. I have news about Helga. Come on, then. The Jarl will want to speak to you So you were at Helga. Saw this dragon with your own eyes. Yes, I did. Yes, please, please, please. Most immediate danger. Dragon will that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should not. 
I must stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Hear that. Then the detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my lord. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done white run service. I won't forget. Keep <laughs> Steel armor added, you can sell that. That is another thing you can do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. God, let's go find Fire and God, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Got it. I actually already know where he is. Right here. Captain the dragon reached to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. Hmm? What? Project? You think you could help me? I really don't think so. The Yarl can be found in the great hall, probably sitting on his Yarl's floor. I think I found over here in the wizard's lab. Right. Go ahead, fill it in, probably. So the Yarl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, you must be referring to my research into the dragon. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be... What? <sighs> Just tell me what I need to do. You are to begin your adventure. Excellent. The sooner begun, the sooner done, eh? I uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleed Bow's Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial plan. Go to Bleed Bow's Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Can <sighs> you tell me about Bleed Bow's Barrow? By the ancient war, perhaps dating back to the dragon war itself. Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. Near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south. Of hey, there. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. All right. How do you know the stone tablet is in Bleak Falls Barrow? Must preserve some professional secrets. Must. I have my sources. Rely. Uh, tell me more about the Dragon War. I'm surprised you've never heard of it. Even I used to think it was just for me, but not anymore. Dragon War was a real event, although only the barest glimmer of the actual event has come down to us. Far back in the mythic era, the dragons were worshipped as gods in Skyrim. Many of the monumental ruins that still dot the landscape were in fact built as temple to the dragon. The details are lost, but at some point, the Nords rebelled. After a long and terrible war, the Nords overthrew their dragon overlords. So, were all the dragons killed in the Dragon War? Oh no. Many were killed, of course. But many survived historically. Why, this very palace was built by one of Valkyrie's ancestors who called the Captive Dragon. Hence its name, Dragon Huh, that's interesting. What have you got for sale? <laughs> so, you wish to master the Yes, of course I do. I just want to know what you have. Spelt. Fast healing. Ooh, I love fast healing. Please. Okay, I need to save up for that. And then I also want, if he has it, Soul Trap. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so I need, uh, okay, 309 plus... Uh, 291. Well, that equals an even 600, so that's good. Alright, so that's two quests where we need to go to Bleak Falls Barrow. Alright, that, that's fine. Actually, I'm going to put both on. Because that'll lead me in the same place, plus it'll lead me in the direction of the Gold Claw once I actually get into Bleak Falls Barrow. 
However, guys, I think that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, like, comment. If not, criticism is always welcome. And I will see you in the next video where I will meet you in River Run to go to Bleak Falls Barrow. See you guys then.